everybody. I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill. Together we are Belisa. Welcome to our channel. Today we actually got to go out to a sit-down restaurant for the first time since this whole coronavirus thing happened. We also hadn't seen Bill's mom for a couple of weeks, so we went out and picked her up, took her out to lunch to celebrate Bill's birthday a couple of days early. Bill's mom is such a hoot and so much fun to be around. Roll the clip. It has grilled chicken breast, bacon, blue cheese, hard boiled eggs, tomatoes, that's and avocado. Yeah, get that for mom. Okay. There's my mom. <laughs> on how she's gonna eat with a mask on, but she's gonna try. <laughs> We're actually in a restaurant. If you want, I can get you scissors and you can just cut it to make it easier to kind of. She's okay. <laughs> Hi, everybody. We are in Hemet at the Red Robin. We have come here with Bill's mom, and this is a celebration for Bill's birthday. We're a little bit early, of course, celebrating early with his mom, but we're so glad the restaurant is open and we could actually come in, what sit restaurant? down, and eat. I said we're at Red Robin. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. I'm not paying attention, as always. <laughs> Red Robin. Yum. Yum. <laughs> there she is. She got her hair did. Yeah. It's nice and empty. Yeah, this is great. They must have just mm. you, you got so some good. bottomless fries? Mm -hmm. For some reason, I can't hold a whole lot of them. Wow, That's look the at that. That's the avocado. Avocado <laughs> salad? Yep. It's and I got... Wonderful. Crispy chicken tender salad. Wow, it's nice. You might get a shirt and a pair of pants. Woo! <laughs> For the price of that lunch, I'm better. Yeah. And I got the Haystack Tavern you always, Double. You always get that. It's so good. I'm and ranch. ranch. She always gets that burger. She likes that burger. So good. Are you happy? Yeah. Good. I'm never going to eat all this either. You're not going to eat all that. So they're just set, they're just seating people far apart. Yeah. It's wonderful. Yeah, it was great. Thank you. you guys can get a bag? Okay, I'll take a bag. Get a bag for your little one. Stay with It's gonna be easier for her to just put it in the car. Okay. Because there's two of them especially. Bye -bye. Now. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Alrighty. Well, well, well. That was totally worth it. That was. I'm so happy to have gotten to eat in a restaurant. Yeah. Woo! First restaurant we've been in and got to sit down and eat of any kind, fast food, sit down, anything. It's the first one in months. So good, and my tummy is full. Cool. Do you need a new phone? No. <laughs> Don't know how to use the one I have. <laughs> <laughs> Put on your seatbelt, please. Okay. Did I have it on before? I don't remember. Yep. <laughs> otherwise it beeps. <laughs> All right. Got the family loaded up. Dashboard and she'll yell at me to put my seatbelt on. What's next on the agenda, Mom? Walmart. Why are we going there? To celebrate your birthday with wonderful clothes. <laughs> From Walmart. Yes. Yeah, Mom. <laughs> it's obvious that we have made it home now. We dropped Bill's mom off at home and we had so much fun seeing her and it was really wonderful 
to actually go out and eat in a restaurant again. You don't even realize how much you miss things like that. It was great. Let's continue on with our day. Bill has just come across some footage from Disneyland that we haven't shown you. It is of the line right when you enter Star Tours. And I know a lot of you have been asking how we're doing with Disneyland being closed. And we are going on Disneyland being closed now for about three months. But if you recall, we have mentioned in the past that in the summer of 2017, we chose to take four months off. One of the reasons was because we wanted to make sure that we weren't totally Disney crazy, but also because we had just purchased our Ram ProMaster high top van and we wanted to take the summer to convert it. We're so glad we did that because we use our van all the time and we absolutely love it. But there is a difference between choosing not to go to Disneyland and absolutely not being allowed to go to Disneyland because it's closed. So while it has been a bummer and we are looking forward to it opening, we are surviving. But in the meantime, we want to share this clip with you from Star Tours. Roll the clip. They don't look suspicious to me at all. Strange, perhaps, but you'll have to excuse us. Sometimes he can be a bit too vigilant. Stop being paranoid, Arthur, and get back to work. They'll be leaving this past. Star Tours is now offering convenient daily departures to the tranquil planet of Naboo. Alright, we're on the go again. We are heading out in our van. We're going to get a movie and some dinner. Let's go. What'd you get at the Ralph store? Red box. The movie we got is called Rogue Warfare. What's that about? The Hunt. It's about a war. I didn't watch the preview, you did. <laughs> but I did see some fighting and some war type stuff. So that's what I'm guessing it's about. <laughs> <laughs> My choice tonight. Yeah. Finally, I don't have to watch some girly chick flick. No. I let you choose because it's almost your birthday. Oh, I see. It's all about you right now. Wow. <laughs> we'll see how long that lasts. <laughs> Heading to our favorite spot. Just around the blocked off top lot. Just around the country store. Where you can get some dipping dots. Hopefully soon. Heading to our favorite spot. Yeah. Jazz hands. I wonder when that country store is going to open. It's got a lot of signs on the door still. Well, people are out and about. We've got some bike riders. We've got some pool swimmers. We've got some geese and their babies. Look at all the babies. Oh my gosh. <laughs> They're having a little geese party. They've all come back to our spot. Yeah, they like it over here. Hello, babies. Those over there, just to the left of the no swimming sign, a little close to us, you can see their flight feathers coming in. Yeah, this GoPro is so wide, it's hard to... Yeah, but those over there are going to be the first ones to fly away. Yep. Look, there they go. They're up and walking. Yeah. Getting their little dark feathers on their booties. Now that's a gaggle of geese. All right, we're 
right, everybody, we have finished watching the movie Rogue Warfare. And you can all thank us right now. Thank you, Bill and Lisa, for watching that for you so that you don't have to. Do not waste your time. It was awful acting, awful writing. And I don't like to give movies a bad review, but do not waste your time on this one. I'm not even gonna give it a grade. There isn't a grade low enough. Even Riley doesn't like the movie and he slept through most of it. <laughs> So don't waste your time with that one. So now we're gonna try to find something. Oh, Rogue Warfare the Hunt. That's it. So we're gonna try to find something else uplifting and entertaining to watch. And then we're gonna head home after this. I hope you enjoyed our video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.